A sphere of radius 50 mm is kept centrally over a frustum of square pyramid of side 120 mm at the bottom, 80 mm at the top and height 100 mm. Draw the isometric projection of the assembly. Draw the reference line XY and mark VP and HP. Use 2H pencil. First we have to draw the top view and front view of the combination of the solids. Then we have to draw the isometric projection of the combined solids. Draw the base of the frustum of the square pyramid of side 120 mm with its side parallel to and below the XY line using 2H pencil. Name the corner points of the square drawn with A, B, C, D for indicating the base side. Then draw the diagonal lines from each corner point to find the axis point O. With respect to the axis point, draw square of side 80 mm over the base square to indicate the top surface and name it as 1, 2, 3, 4 for indicating the top surface. With O as center and radius as 50 mm, draw a circle to indicate the sphere. Then draw thick lines for visible parts in top view and dashed lines for hidden parts of top base. Also join the corners A, B, C and D with corners 1, 2, 3 and 4 respectively to indicate the slant edges. Mark the dimension of sphere using H pencil with symbol S pi in front of 100. Also mark the dimensions of the top and bottom bases using H pencil. Thus, the top view of frustum of square pyramid and sphere is completed. To draw the front view of the frustum of the pyramid, project the axis point to the XY line and project it to frustum height 100 mm. Project the corners of top base to the axis length and project the bottom base to the XY line. Join the bottom and top points using H pencil. Name the corner points respectively. Then draw the circle of radius 50 mm above the frustum along the axis using H pencil. Mark the dimension of the axis length and sphere with H pencil and complete the front view of the frustum of square pyramid and sphere.
Draw horizontal line at any convenient distance and mark point A on it. Draw two isometric axes with 30 degree angle from this point and construct the square in isometric scale. Isometric scale equals 0.82 into actual scale and mark the corner points of the square on the intersection of the axes and mark all the sides of the square as A, B, C and D. Then draw vertical lines from each corner point of height equal to axis height in isometric scale and complete the box. On the top surface of the box, mark the points 1, 2, 3 and 4 by measuring the distance of each corner of the top surface with respect to the bottom surface in the top view which is drawn already. Use isometric scale. Then mark the center point of the sphere O in isometric scale at a height 41 mm, 50 into 0.82 from the center of the top base of the frustum. Then circle with actual radius 50 mm is drawn with that center O using H pencil. Please note, here we are not drawing the circle with respect to isometric scale because the size of sphere will not change if we see it from any view. Join all the visible points 1, 2, 3 and 4 in the top face by continuous dark line using H pencil. Then join the extreme visible slant edges of the pyramid that lie in front of the isometric axes with dark lines using H pencil.
Then join the visible base edges of the bottom base with dark lines using H pencil and complete the isometric projection of the combination of the first term of the square pyramid and sphere.